Hello, everybody. I am Dennis. I am working the public relations department in our company, and I genuinely appreciate the opportunity that I could come and working with you guys in this amazing project. And so, I guess the reason why I came here is because uh, this project is a PR project has a PR problem. So, continuing planned and active participation with and within community to maintain and enhance uh, its environment to benefit both our own company and the community uh, is a PR, what is what PR do. In other words, we are building a mutually beneficial relationship between ourselves and community and publics. So in this project, we are required to build a online com online uh, community to showcase uh, our interaction with audience while uh, the social impact our promotion. So which means we are built a relationship between our publics, between our customer. So this is a PR problem. And specifically, it's a OPR problem, the organization initiate public relation problem. So I will explain for you what is the OPR problem. So the organizational, uh, the organization initiate public relation problem is our company have sensed a potential problem affecting as affecting uh, our publics and our own interest. For example, in this project, our biggest problem is we want people to talk about more about our brands, to talk about more about our toilet paper. So this is, and we want to use the social media platform to boost, to stimulate, to uh, do those actions that we are pursue. So we call it the public as organization initiate public relation OPR. Uh, from the key publics, I personally recommend we locate our key publics to a group of loyal customer we call its active publics in our industry and inactive publics. So about the group of loyal customer, they have high involvement, they are high recognition, they know what our company do they know our brand and they use our brand they are the best uh, speak person for our brands and they feel personally affected by what we do so if we want to build online community they are the best choice to say something to interact with us and the reason why i also choose the inactive publics is they have the huge uh, possibility. They are, uh, they are those group unaware or only minimally, uh, minimally familiar with our brand, with our products. And uh, I think they have the, uh, they could be affected by our active uh, publics. So we could use our active public to lure our inactive publics. So I would say uh, both inactive and active publics can be our key publics in this project. About the solution in this project, I assign it into four parts. The first part is a key message. The second, further research. The third, uh, the channels that we, lead, we will recommend. Four tactics. So let's jump into the first part, the key message. So I would uh, recommend to use comment and tell us about you and Bola. Simple, easy to understand, and strong. So the reason why I use comment and tell instead of like us social media posts is because comment can be called more action instead of the simple click of likes. So in social media area, we defined likes as a vanity affordance, which means there's no valuable to evaluate whether our post is 
successful or not because we can spend money to buy likes but we can't spend money to get comments or share. So this is why I use comment and share instead of the simple likes. And uh, we encourage people to tell their story about our products, about our toilet paper, so that more people would say a customer already who already use our uh, products experience and the second part is for the research I need to conduct so before we uh, plan or take action of our the, of this project we need to do some formative research so for example what platform our customer are on Facebook the Instagram the TikTok Twitter the snapchat and what types of content they are interested in are they interested in the content with video, content with image, content with links, or are they interested in uh, our content be more informative, uh, like provide more information about our products, or our content be more funny, be more interesting, like we provide some, uh, we post some memes. So we need to figure it out. And we also need to evaluate specific uh, platforms users information for example social media by gender by age by what times they are uh, mostly like uh, mostly like to use and uh, how many times they spend on social media uh, the funding the funding fund i recently i read about the census 2018 social media report in australia the male, uh, the men are more likely to use social media on toilet than women. Does it mean we need to target more uh, men than women on our social media platform? So we need to evaluate. Uh, in third part, the channels, I recommend to use Facebook. Uh, like I said, the census 2018, the social media research in Australia recommend us 94% of Australians use social uh, use Facebook. So the Facebook has the biggest knowledge of uh, users in Australia. And in our company, we want to use word of mouth to improve our brand awareness. So the Facebook about connection, it's about build relationship, the family, the co-worker, the friends. So when we comment something or when we share something, all our, I would say, personal stakeholder will say. So they could probably join with our um, interaction with our posts. So this is why I recommend Facebook. About tactics, I recommend to use 80 20 rules so 80 percent of our content focuses on the engagement post post and uh, post some interesting information such as uh, you know our company donate 50 percent of our profits to sanitize sanitation and to help building a toilet in developing country so we could um, use some of those information post on social media because people buy our products they have relation they could feel something for example i buy the bola toilet paper for myself uh, also i could help someone wait so this is a win-win situation we call this mutually beneficial relationship and 20% of information are promotes. So um, customer, especially our inactive publics, they are seeking the information without promotion. So they would like to jump into more uh, valuable, I would say, or more interesting or informative post instead of the the information that we lead, we uh, motivate people to take action because social media is all about build awareness to improve our brand awareness 
and about the 12 month plan, I will recommend 20% like that, the promotion post, and the 30% is engagement post, and 50% is valuable information on our social media. I also recommend to use our own media. So in our own website, we can write a story about our own brands and the reason why the reason uh, why we donate 50 of per percent to help those country and those people. Overall, in this project, we are talking about the importance of providing the information that my customer and who engage with us could find it valuable and worthy. So we need to focus on how can we possibly engage with them and how can they interact with us as well. So we are not only focused on promotional message because the social media is about improve awareness and eventually we hope uh, could improve our promotion. But our company want to use word of mouth to demonstrate the excellent customer service with us. So we need to net our customer to talk, to speak, to share their story. I guess this is the most important thing of this project. Thank you very much.